I know you more on the car, Jay, but look at that right there. That's a dang ran right there. See? Oh, yeah, it's beautiful, Catfish. Yeah. Not really into guns, man. More of a lover, not a fighter. There you go. That's your trouble, you. You're thinking you get to choose. Where's Cobb? Uh, I think he's uh, fixing a forklift. You hand checked that truck to Iberia this morning. Yeah, Gil, it's in the computer. Don't want to hear about any more short loads. Look, Mr. Gillespie, I got these two loads that I'm trying to get ready for freight, and then I got two more that I'm trying to prep, man. I mean... Jake, when I promoted you to shift supervisor, it's because you said you could handle the extra responsibility. Now, if you can't, tell me, because it's my ass on the line, not yours. Gil, we're good. Hey. It's my ass. Not yours. <laughs> Man, that guy promoted me just to shovel more of his work on me, you know? Just another day of missing visiting hours, that's all that means. Oh, yeah, how is that red hot mama of yours, anyway? That's gross. <laughs> you talk about my mom like that, it's weird. You know, man, um, she got another round of chemo and she'll be okay. You bet she is, you're gonna pull through. Well, let's quit farting around. Back to work. Huh? <laughs> Yeah, well, I certainly do apologize, sir. <laughs> just, uh, no, no, of, of course we appreciate your business. Uh, this is just what we call uh, simple human error. Thank you. Mr. Gillespie, moment, please. Check that out. Yeah, hey man, what's going on in there? I heard another truck come up short. I'd say it's back curtains for Gillespie this time. I should say something. I gotta go do something. I'll tell you what you do. Call your ex. Olivia. Call Olivia, man. Have a put in a word with the hubby. <laughs> Maybe say Gillespie's job. Won't do it. Man, it's been three years. I don't know. You and her, you're special. Kevin's wife, man, she can't say it's someone's job. That's the stupidest idea. All right, well, you asked. Hey, hey, sorry to interrupt, guys. Not uh, a good time. Hey, Mr. Gillespie, I just need look, you to Look, Mr. Gillespie on... is no longer with us, okay? Put any paperwork on my desk. Wait, no, Kevin, look, is this Look, at the office, area? it's Mr. Weiss. I go back to no, work. Hey, you know... It's not a good time, Jake. God damn it, Kevin. Way to make the tough call there, boss man. Excuse me, Anthony? Hard-working old man like that. Hey. What the hell, let's get rid of them. Somebody gotta take the fall. Buck gotta stop somewhere, and not with you. Is this funny to you? Well, it's not like ha-ha funny, no. How about joining them? Would that be funny? How about you try that? I'll go right to corporate. Who I'm sure would love to hear about your erratic behavior. Frequent catnaps. You push a button on a large machine, and you hardly do that well. Don't act like you're so special that anyone would miss you if you were gone. They won't. So, back to work, man. There you go, man. Pretty much done. Well, now, come on. Need a ride? Ah, uh, no, man, I'm good. All right, but I won't be off forever now. I'm all right, man. Walking helps me, uh, you know, clear my head. Don't know how you do it walking all the time. <laughs> all right, man. See you later, Catfish. Get a couple more uh, shotgun bumper stickers. Later, boy.
Who's, uh, who's Sweet Stang is that outside? Look like a valet to you? I save you a seat. Hey, what's up, boss? Do a beat. Is you still drinking a beer? Hey, man, does a frog scratch his ass when he farts? <laughs> Here's to the life, huh? Yeah, carry on. Hey, Grandpa. Hey, 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 watch out, you. Might have to take you over my knee. <laughs> oh, that would be interesting. Teach him some manners. Oh, yeah, I tried. You failed. <laughs> but I do crave discipline. Maybe you should take me over your knee. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> She likes me. Oh, yeah, you think she likes the old ones, huh? No, not the older ones, the classics. Hey, speaking of which, you see that GT out in the yard? Oh, hell yeah. yeah you see that GT out there? I'm sorry to break up the park. Get in the yard there, right there. Mm. Don't make him be there. Yeah, thanks for bringing the bad news, Catfish. Always good to see you. I didn't know he was going to be here tonight. I don't want to bring you down. You didn't fire him. That son of a bitch Kevin did, but that's going to come back on him. You know what goes around comes around. It's called karma, boy. You know what? It just seems like there's guys out there that they can't even fail if they try. Uh-oh. Hey, Judy, bring two of these, will you? We're going to need them. You know, I box bolts and straps for a living. That's what we do. We, we, we take bolts and straps and we put them in a box. Like, what kid wants to do that when they grow up? I mean, you're gonna do other things. You're still young. No, still young. You know what? What do I have to look forward to, Cobb? You know, I got my mom. She's dying of cancer. I mean, my brother, he's calling me all the time, asking me to help him pay these bills and can't afford a car to walk. I'm walking all around town trying to get where I'm going. You know, and I got this scum bucket of a boss married to my ex girlfriend. <laughs> she's like, ever since I left that girl, man, she's like, first domino in this long line. Bad decisions. Well, things work out. Like I said, you're still young. You're not even listen to me. Yeah, I'm listening to you, man. Why don't you listen to me for a minute? <laughs> hey, look, look at this. Hey, you know what that is? That's a court order. Let me tell you a story. The old man fall in love, yeah. She's a young girl. I thought she loved me too. She, we had a kid together. I mean, I'm thinking wedding bells, white picket fences. Woo! I guess she wasn't thinking that way because this is what love looks like, man. That's a court order. That says that I cannot come within 500 yards of my own son. My own son! I mean, she came right in hell, but I would like to see my boy now and again. Yeah, you got problems, you know? I'll tell you something about the courts. They're gonna side with the woman every time. Don't matter if she's the woman of your dreams or a frigid, cold, vindictive bitch. <laughs> anyway, we all got problems, Jake. Hey, man, I'm sorry about that. I didn't know you had a kid. Man, that's all right, don't matter. All I'm saying is, we all get dealt cause. It's how you play them, and man, Play yours, better not play mine. Hey, thanks, man. Hey, I'm gonna be right back, all right? Yeah, I'm gonna go get some air myself. Ow! Yeah. Hitting me like that. Hey, Gil. Look, man, I'm sorry about the way things went down today. Nah, it's not so bad, kid. Don't worry about it. Hell, you give me a second chance at life. And after all, man, my age, you should have no problem finding another job. Well, with the job market being in such good shape and all, as am I. Plus, with my generous severance package, future's looking pretty damn bright. I guess I should be thanking you, Jake. That what you come over here for? So as I could thank you? 
Yeah, I was just doing. Sorry. Uh, uh, uh. Hey, boy. Bought you something to ease the pain. I hope you notice now. Try to stick up for you back there, anyway. Kevin Weiss has had a bean up his butt about me from the start. Mm -hmm. What is that? It's just some ugly old thing my dad would give me as a boy. Should have got rid of it a long time ago. It's a monkey's paw. Who? What? Monkey's paw? My dad said it'll do magic if he wanted to. Magic? What kind of monkey magic? <laughs> some kind of hoodie? Never would have taken you as an old beer, man. A little too pale. <laughs> I'll tell you honestly, I'm not sure what it is. But I'll tell you this. My daddy said it could take hold of a man's life. Move the pieces around. Just gets passed on from one person to the next. Bending a man's fate to his own will. Giving him whatever he wants. How? How does it work? Three bones. Three good wishes that only its owner can ask. I mean, you ever seen it actually work, you know? The wishes? Of course. I wish for eternal good looks. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Shop. All right. Won't be too hard. I wish for that bitch in GT outside. All right. Felt good. <laughs> you guys feel that? With my turn. No. It is now. Won't work for no one else till he finishes his three bones. I can't. It's yours. Mm -hmm. Is you know it from your dad? No. Nope. It's yours now. Just an old trinket, anyhow. Do me a favor, getting that thing out of my sight. Consider it a peace treaty. No hard feelings. No hard feelings, boy. Hey, still here. Man, she is pretty. Whose is that? Look at that. Whoa. Whoa. Come on, man. Let's go. I'm getting tired. How about that? Damn. Damn, Jake. Keys are in it. Look for yourself. Whoa. How about that? That thing worked. Come on, man. You know it's a coincidence. Maybe. car's not in the driveway. I don't think she's home. Hmm. Exactly what was the plan here? What do you feel? You're going to drive up and uh, sweep her off her feet, drive off into the sunset, just the three of us? 
You ready to go? I'm ready to go. No, no, hold on. Hold on. Just so it shouldn't be a total loss. Cobb, what are you doing? Uh, just stay in the car, Jake. Cobb. You don't get your panties in a twist. Get back in the car. No, no, it's all right. I'm just going to... I'm going to leave a message. Oh, John, it'll... It'll call it's our time. boss's house. No, seriously, about... stop. Don't do that. Don't ever do that. Come on, man. We got to go, all right? All right, but don't forget. You mess with the cop, you get the corn. Huh? <laughs> Nasty drunk, you know that? Uh oh. What's going on, Jake? Hey, Olivia. Kevin's not home. A little late for stopping by, don't you think? Is it? Um. Sorry, I'm not on my phone, on me. You drunk? No. Oh. You know Tony, he works at the factory. Hi, Tony. Whose car? Uh, it's mine. You have a car now? Yeah. I wished for it. Okay. Hey, oh, Lydia, um... Well, part of this, don't you understand? Where's Kevin? At this time of night, shouldn't he be home? He's prepping for the fundraiser at St. Luke's. But I just drove by there and they're all closed up, so I will be expecting him back shortly. Why are you looking for him? Um. Here for you. <laughs> yeah, that's one thing you've never been. It's really mean. And really not nice. Okay, I married you. Too little, too late. Says who? Me. Go home before Kevin gets home and fires your ass. Good night, Tony. Hey. Gosh, she's really pretty. We got a fetching girl, is See the way she look at you? I think you got a shot. You think you got a shot with her? He's gonna twist his titties at Warthog if he was home, that's all. He's gonna break his chops a little bit. Yeah, it didn't seem like you were breaking chops, did it? Well, what did it look like? I don't know. It looks like maybe you were losing your mind a little bit, that's oh, what. Yeah. Hey, man, I'm not the one making wishes on a monkey's paw, am I? Huh? Losing my mind. Maybe I am losing my mind. Hey, look, man, I'm sorry about that. What? Hey, hey, boy. What's that? Hey, buddy. Cop. I'm gonna call for help.
wish you weren't dead. How on earth, sir? I need an ambulance fast as you can, all right? Uh, I'm a, I'm a ways out on I-10, uh, near Metairie. I didn't see a damn thing. I, I don't know. I just I I was driving along on the road and then I just stopped and I saw him and I think this fellow's dead. Just I don't know. I you need to come now. Yes. I told you I don't know what's going on. three brothers. As we speak, one's locked up in Jeff Parrish. One's an MP, one's a minor league hockey forward. My ex used to call him Haymaker Bailey. So you see, I've had my fair share of hatching up noggins over the years. I still say I ought to go to the hospital, but no one listens to me. I don't feel nothing. Tough stuff, huh? Impressive. Poor thing. Been through a trauma your beard is all white. Now we used to have a thing for the old fellers.
brought someone home. I don't know what that is. Interesting. Okay, and I'm freaking bored, all right? Turns out. There wasn't much to work with anyway. I'll call you back. I think you should go home. Send John back to that Abbey of yours. Hey, where are you going with that? That's my hoodie. you with something, sir. Hey, son. This you and me go fishing. You've got about two minutes. Response time around here is pretty good. You are not invited. What'd you do to your face? You know what, actually, I don't care. Yes, hello? I need police, please. Look at Restraining you. Restraining order violation. Grown up, get big. You stay away from him. You get off of my property now. Huh? No, ma'am. He's not my husband. Yes, he's driving away. Mm -hmm. I'll stay on the phone with you. Look, I'm just trying to find my friend, all right? C-O-B-B. -B. He's not in the ER. Hey, Jacob, what? You see cop? How you seen him? All right, thank you. Hey, I'll check outside and maybe a better place. We usually like to kick up a pepper, but I don't know. Look, what do I look like? His mother catfish? I'm sure he's fine. Ah. Right. The damn car that I yeah. Oh, Jake. Is there something I can do? Yeah, give me a do-over. This whole thing, all of it. Can you do that? That's what I thought. Oh, man, I'm good. Okay, that's it right there. The last straw, boy. No more. But boy, no one do nothing in the hallway. That's the hallway you do. See you, catfish. Enjoy your weekend.
Surprise. I thought you were dead. I believe I was. That's impossible. It's the ball, Jake. Three wishes. First the car. Then me. You wished this on me, didn't you? Didn't you? No. Yeah, you did. Cobb, no. I, I want mean. that third wish. Must be even said there is no wish. It's it's the paw, it's trash. It's a trinket. It's Olivia, isn't it? What are you talking about? Jay. You don't gotta waste that third wish on her. You're gonna get her back without wishing. I promise you. I'll see you later. Alligator. Hope you don't mind the change of setting. No, I don't mind, baby. Cozy. Hello? What the hell are you doing here? Overtime? No, 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 I push a button on a large machine, and I hardly do that too good, but you know what? I do it just good enough. No, 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 wait, 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 just listen to me. Cobb! Oh, stop acting like you so special, ain't gonna miss you when you're gone. No, 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 wait, 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 w
Hey, Charlie. Yeah, I know, man. I'm on my way. You sure you're all right, JJ? No, I'm fine. You know, just some late nights, a couple, uh, a little bit of trouble at work, that's all. Thank you, man. Thanks, Andy. It's not layoffs, is it? I mean, we can still carry most of Mom's bill, but I'll still need some help like we talked about. Yeah, we're good. It's not layoffs. How's Mom doing, by the way? You'd know if you went and visited her. Come on, Charlie. But he's doing fine, Jake. You'll come in and visit her, all right. When? Yeah, you better get that. Honey. Hey. Hey. Hey, Jake. I, uh, sorry to bother you. I didn't know who else to call. Are you all right? Um, Kevin didn't come home last night. He didn't have to come all the way down here. You sound pretty shaken up. He stood up before, but not this long. Well, I'm sure he's just cooling off. Tell you the truth, it's the cooling off that's a problem. Me and him. You and him what? I don't even know anymore. I need to get back to things. Hey, let me buy you a cup of coffee. I know it's hard for you to believe. He was really good to me when we first started out. He listened. Sorry, what was he? Of course he listens. He was your AA sponsor. He used to be present. He wasn't afraid of the future, and I needed that after you. I wasn't afraid of the future. No, you just never even thought about it. It's worse. I got an idea. Come on, come with me. Afraid of the future. I knew you'd sit with me as soon as I saw you walking there. I'm sure you did. Palms or cards? What's your pleasure? Cards. <laughs> I beg your pardon? You have willingly entered into the combination of that what is dark. Now you sit responsible for the man with no soul. He's upon your life. You make him, so he makes you. Got you where? Olivia. What did you do? Now it's my turn. There is no wish. All right, the car was already there, cop. And you're not dead. I want it, Jake. I don't have it. I mean, I went looking for it, and I can't find it. I'm sorry. I can't help you. My mom's cancer helped me. My brother sets me to help her pay her bills. I don't know what broke inside you, but something's broken, man. I get it. you a damn thing. Yeah, you do. How are we doing, Miss Betty? Better in Custer, worse than I'd like. My youngest supposed to visit today, but we'll just see. That sounds nice. We'll be back to check on you in a little bit.
Jake? I'm a friend of your son. He asked me to come back. I'm sorry. What for, Tom? I'm gonna put my hands over your face now. It's all right. I've been there. Not so bad. Jake. Cindy, hey, where, where is she? What happened? There was something with her heart. I'm not quite sure. Where's Charlie? He's on his way back from Baton Rouge. I'm so sorry. Can I see her? They're not letting anybody in. Where is she? Where'd they, where'd they do with her? So what'd they Jane? do with her? Don't go crazy, it was just her time. What did you do? Come see me. We'll talk. Where? Was it you? I did it for you, Jake. That'll do. You are one selfish son of a bitch, Jake. You got what you want. You got your girl back. The bomb is in peace. It's my time now. What do you want? I want my boy. I want him to love me. I want you to wish my son back into my life. I don't have him. <laughs> 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 I'm not on anything. Okay. So some old grump gives you this. What was it? A paw. A paw. Which is where now? I threw it away. A paw. Says so you get three wishes. You wish for a car, which you then steal. It's hard to explain. I'm doing all right, I think. You steal it, you wreck it, your buddy from work gets chunked in the brains, but you wish him back to life, maybe, and now he's threatening people you know if you don't give him your last wish. And also, you're not on drugs and leave anything out. Yeah, sarcasm, Charlie. Hell yes, sarcasm. I just lost my mother. It sounds crazy. Yeah. Yeah, it does, Jake. Guys, you need to call the police. No, no, I know, I know. I think you guys need to get out of town until all this boils over, just for a bit. JJ, what have you done? Hey. 
We could take a few days off up at the cabin. Might be good for you, for us, after your mom and all. Mr. Tilton, Detective Margulies. So, uh, this man you say is making threats against you. When did you see him last? Um, this morning. He assaulted me. Uh, got some bruises, I see. He also murdered my mother. Yeah, about that, uh, I spoke with the attending over at Charity, and they're saying heart failure. When was the last time you saw Kevin Weiss? Why? What does this have to do with anything? You know he's dead. Somebody crushed him in one of your industrial presses over at the supply warehouse where you and he and this Mr. Cobb all work. Tony Cobb. He did this, man. He can't believe it. How long have you been seeing the late Mr. Weiss's wife? Where are you getting your information? An anonymous tip. Tony Cobb. You haven't denied it yet. Tony Cobb is behind all this. I remember you. You were here the other morning. You looked like you needed someone to talk to. What's on your mind? Am I under arrest? No. No, not yet. But if you leave town, that could be a big problem. didn't you? What this thing did? I knew it was bad luck. I figured you deserve some. Did you ever use it? I never had the guts. My daddy did, though. We used to own 30 acres of land just past the point there. My daddy, mom, brother, and me. My brother hated it here, so he joined the corps as soon as he hit 18. Mom wasn't happy about it, but she, she loved him something fierce. He, my daddy, my daddy was so pissed off. So he rented out my brother's room to make sure he'd never come home. One night a wandering weird fella he passes through port and needs a place to stay. And he can't pay, so he shows my, my daddy a collection of trinkets to barter with. And among them was this one little monkey's paw. He tells me, wish on it three times, give a man whatever he desires. And it's a joke. My daddy wishes it to help pay off his mortgage. They think nothing of it. Travel spends the night, gone for the sun come up next morning. A day later, we get where my brother died in combat. But then we get his life insurance policy. The exact price of the mortgage. To the penny. <laughs> and the family will never 
the same after that. What happened? With the other two wishes? Let's just say my mom would have done anything to see my brother's face again. did something to Cobb. I don't know what, but he's different, psychotic, soulless. Yeah. God should have got rid of that damn thing all years ago. So look, I, I mean, if I have this monkey's paw and it works, right? Well, then I can just wish all this undone. It'll give you what you ask for, but not the way you want it. It takes from what's there and spits it back darker. Poison. Don't bring any more misery upon yourself. It must be gone well, doesn't nobody look back now. Yeah, let's get out of here. <laughs> A little bit. Jackson, which was named after Andrew Jackson. Right. Nevada. Uh, Carson City. Hold on, baby. Stay right here. Are you Abby? He came by here. His face. He seemed different. Oh, I don't know. What happened to him? Um, I don't know. Something bad. Whatever it is, I feel responsible. <laughs> no. Mm -mm. No. You didn't make him what he is. You see, Tony was always a bad egg. I guess that's how I got in trouble with him in the first place. I liked bad eggs. Now I'm paying for it. So what are you going to do now? I don't know. So I'm trying to figure out.
Big son bitch, about six foot two, drives an old model four by four. Sounds familiar. I think it might be that Tony Cobb character, sir. The warehouse is the connection. You know, I don't see Jake Tilton as this mad ripper type, and the Weiss widow, she doesn't have the physical strength. So Cobb, he's our best bet. Look, I'm gonna go track her down. See if you can land eyes on Tilton. Right him on. Because I'm not. Now, the so-called police called us a throwdown fee. We got file number, got no paper. You can't have it if you need it. Just keep my name all the way out. It's for self-defense, if that matters. Sure. You need to borrow your truck. Yeah. Some bad groovy blow around here last few days. You got Bob Kevin. And Paul Gilly. Gillespie. I'm not down here, here. You're early tonight. I buy that trailer here. Somebody done burn up his cot real good. I tell you, working for the bond of wrong. Worse for your health than smoking. Yeah. Thanks, Catfish. I owe you one. Not till I need something. I'll dig it, boy. Not so much for love and not a fight out, huh? My brother may be a screw up. My woman's an absolute rock. Get the gas.
Look at this jerk. I've seen that truck. This can't be happening. Charlie, hey, what's up? What does he drive? What? Cobb, his car, what is it? He drives an old car. Um, but he got behind on his payments and he doesn't even have it anymore. Why? Okay. It's not him. Never mind. We're uh, on our way to the cabin. We thought. Uh, oh, shake. <laughs> we thought it was him. It's just some jackass tailgating in a busted 4x4. Four four. Charlie! following us. He intends to harm us. We need the authorities out here. <laughs> uh, well, reckon I'm the authorities around here, fella. The real police! Aggravation I do not need. Hey! Hey! I'm just gonna, uh, I'm just gonna go, all right? Sandy. Sandy. Charlie, what are you doing? What are you now?
thought you might be here. I want my lawyer. I'm not taking you in. Not like that, anyway. So what, then? Have you spoken to Mr. Tilton? No, but he didn't do it. You weren't so sure the other day. I am now. It wasn't him. Well, I believe you. Do you know someone named Anthony Cobb? Oh, God. Look, I want to take you to a safe location, somewhere we can keep our eyes on you, protect you. What about Jake? Him, too. It's going to be all right. Why is all of this happening? Well, it's hard to say, but the awful truth is bad things happen all the time, especially around here. I just want to... I just want to make sure nothing happens to you. If you come with me, all right? Okay. Let me get my stuff. Talking to you? What the hell was that? You just put that lane in the trash can, man. I don't care where you're from, that's bad manners. So here's what's gonna happen. Once you let her out of that trash can, what you are gonna do, my friend, I'm gonna teach you a thing or two about proper etiquette with the ladies. Let's rock. Let's roll.
all right? Where's Cobb? He's inside. Yeah, I heard him. And screaming. He killed a cop, Jake. Yeah, he, um... Something bad happened to him. I don't know. I don't really know how to explain it. What is that? It's what started it. Now I'm going to end it. me to be here and here I am. Uh, 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 Please don't do anything. Listen. Just let her go. things man it takes what you want and it ruins it just like it ruined you hey you were right at the bar the other night when you told me that um I didn't appreciate anything I was taking it all for granted my job my family my friend look around this is all my fault this isn't on anyone else. This is on me, man. Fixer! Fixer! Okay.
I just want to take my boy fish. Where's the ball? Where's the ball? The ball. Sir, he's up on the night. No, you're not listening. Where's the ball? Sir, come out. Hey, no, no. Hey, where's the ball? No! 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 He's up on the night. Where's the ball? Where's the ball? buckled up. 